A very warm welcome to the Total Power Stadium at Holm Park, the home of Sheppard United Football Club, the Merritt Kent Football Association Under-14 Boys Plate Final. It's AFC Langney against Ebbsfleet United. Let's take a check on the two lineups. First of all, AFC Langley. They'll be playing in the all dark blue. Their manager is Gavin Boddy, their assistant manager, Lee Hall, and their coach is Raymond Mead. Their opponents today, Ebbsfleet United in red shirts and white shorts. Their manager is Tom Ponton, and the coach is Darren Gresley. Today's referee, Caden Abnett, assisted by Benjamin Harold and Harley Webster. The fourth official is Harry Clifford. Long pump downfield from Harvey Hall. Turned by Reynolds. Ponton against Crook. Gets a better of Crook. That's a lovely through ball. And yet Egberna. Great challenge coming in from Jaden Adset. That really was a perfectly timed challenge by the AFC Langley captain by Barrow a lovely through ball and yet Egberna yeah. scores an Ebbsfleet lead he scored 40 goals this season and he showed there just how clinical he is in front of goal the outside of the right boot and he put power in it too to beat Harvey Hall and he's quick he's powerful and as you can see there he knows how to finish too Lovely pass in towards the back post. Priestman! Well, it looked like he was going to equalise, but a brave save by Luca Pollard, who then collided with the post. Loves ball forward, and off goes Anya Igbuna again. Anya Igbuna cuts inside and shoots just over. Away in the midfield is Niall Canning. It's a high ball up towards Anya Ebuna. Taking over is Adam Love. Still Adam Love. Tries the chip and it's 2-0. A very good finish from Adam Love. Extends Ebbsfleet's advantage. Cuts across to two defenders. Has a little look up and chips it over the goalkeeper. And into the far post. AFC Langley taking no chances. James Nelson puts it wide. Luca Pollard clears. It's back over the top again. Goalkeeper comes out. He's not able to grab it ahead of Anya Egbuna. Shot is from Billy Ponton straight at the goalkeeper, Harvey Hall. Neatly played by Datlin. And a shot by Love right into the top corner. And that's 3-0. And a second goal in this cup final for Adam Love. Has a look up. He goes for the top corner. The goalkeeper can't quite get there. Surely now Ebbsfleet have got their hands on the silverware. It's another really good ball through by Stokowski. It's Datlin. Another very well-timed challenge by Jaden Adset. Ball forward from Fentiman. Managed to ride the challenge. It's Datlin. Good save by Harvey Hall. And there goes the final whistle. Two goals for Adam Love and one for Anya Egbuna. Gives us a scoreline of AFC Langley nil, Ebbsfleet United three. Two goals in the final for Adam Love. He has been named player of the match. Well, they won the league title last season and AFC Langley have certainly given a good impression of themselves in this final beaten by a, the better side in the end but they kept going to the end and they never gave up they defended well Some good saves from Harvey Hall 
AFC Langley beat Snodgrass Town Nomads, Woodcombe, Staplehurst, Deal Town Rangers and Real 60 on their way to the final. And up come the winners, Ebbs Fleet United. And they've managed to see off Kings Hill Colts 10-0 in round one. And then Folkestone and Victor, Dance and Sports, VCD Athletic, all been defeated on their way to the final. It's their first season, and what a first season it has been for Ebbs Fleet United. Last in line is their captain, Alfie Barrow, scorer of 45 goals this season. Alfie Barrow is presented the Merritt Kent Football Association under 14 boys play. It's congratulations to Ebbsfleet United. <laughs>